Alright, um, this video is going to be about how to get Maple Story into window mode. See what you do here? See, this is the program to put it into window mode. Alright, so I have mine in the H drive, so don't worry, close this real quick. So, all you gotta do basically is let's open a new window, I guess. Google it. It's not that hard. Let's see. Google. Google DXWND. Very easily to find. File front. But very good. Stupid pop up crap. Um. Alright, so. Download is very small as you can see. It's not a huge program like Zentire which sucks. So you just go to download now and you're gonna wanna save it. Alright, so I'm not gonna do that because I don't need to. So I'm just gonna open up DXWND. Hmm. Um <clears throat> when you first get it you gotta find where it is. You see this is uh another server. You see, because since normally it'll it'll always it'll most likely have it in the C drive. If if yours is in the C drive, just go to edit, <coughs> sorry, modify, and then search for it. That's all you gotta do. All right. So and when you do that, when you change where it is, you gotta double click it. Do not close this window at all. You close it, you will close window mode. Just minimize. It. Alright, then click play. Game guard will come up, obviously. And should show up anytime soon. Voila. Window mode. Um, I suggest for a little bit because it will freeze up a set, like a couple seconds. So, because if you have something running while it's starting up, it'll start messing up. See, look at that. See? Window mode. Perfect, huh? Let me log in. Watching my pin. But basically, you got your window. It's not very hard to find. Um, you just gotta search DHND, click the first one, it's very easy. Alright, this is Alright, he's not my main character, but I use him a lot because I'm trying to run at, um, the NX. So, most likely, you'll be fine, if you're gonna, f if you need to find me, I'm gonna be in channel 1, FM. I'm not sure which FM, because every day I, I go to a different one because, um, my spot gets taken up. But basically, that's one of my characters. Because I'm trying to record it, see, it's my guy. I got right there. I don't spot this spot. I'm just not gonna worry about that. Oh, never mind. This spot. Alright. Um, I will show you my level 60, which is my real main. If you wanna add me that way, it's a lot easier. But base, but, since Zentar has gone down, no one's been able to hack. There have been no hack reports whatsoever. Um, for some reason, DXWND was not patched. Maybe they didn't know about it because not everyone used DXWND. Because you don't need to have DXWND running when you use Zentar. So it was perfect, basically. So you could just have it and perfect. Alright, this is my illegit level 60 wizard. Right there. Illegit. Strength. Dex. Luck. And obviously. Only got 10 fame. Hey, what do you know? 10 more levels and I could zack him. I should do that. So basically, there's my guy. No. Um, illegit stats. Illegit stats. Illegit stats. What do you know? Alright, so. These are what you get him up to. You want to, you want to get him Thunder first, then MP Eater Meditation, then Cold Beam, and then Teleport Fan on. Not that hard. So basically, 
if you didn't get it, I was just showing you was a demonstration of how to use it. This is what you'll need. You close it, you'll close the window as well. Um, I'll do it because I need to turn it off as soon as I can because I'm split on Maple Sword. But if you want to test it out, go ahead. Don't mess up the game whatsoever. It's just not really smart to turn it off to do that. And that's it. Any questions, leave a comment on the YouTube. Or if you have Maple Sword, just try and find either this guy or the guy before. Alright?